This is Barry again. It's 5.47 a.m. And I guess we call this a, um, a sunrise video. I had a little story I wanted to tell you about something that <clears throat> happened to me uh, probably about 95 or 94 around there. I was um, delivering newspapers on a, a street. Well, this is Shreveport, Louisiana, by the way. Uh, but there was this, there's a street called Greenwood Boulevard. It's a dead end street. And I went down to the end and I was coming back out. And about halfway out, there was some guy standing there with some something burning in his hand. And as I drove by, he threw it at me. And it hit the uh, the passenger side of my car just behind the front wheel <clears throat> and uh, there were flames all on that side of the car he had thrown a Molotov cocktail at my car and of course I didn't stop uh, you know it was dark it was probably I don't know probably around 3.30 in the morning So, I drove back out up to um, Greenwood Road and um, made a right and just the little way is there at the intersection of um, Pines Road and Greenwood Road, there's a gas station where once they used to have pay phones. You know, not everybody had a cell phone back then in the early 90s, but um, I called 911 and um, I happened to tell them somebody threw a, a Molotov cocktail at me and the um, what's going on there and uh, the 911 operator laughed at me and said, what kind of drink did they throw at you? And hung up. Luckily, the fire went out pretty quickly um, as I was driving away. Um, <laughs> I didn't think much of it the guy who threw that at me or the uh, 911 operator but luckily he didn't hit square in the windshield with that thing but um, I guess you call those uh, Molotov cocktails a firebomb I guess you get a jar with flammable liquid and stuff a piece of cloth into it and you light the cloth and when the bottle breaks you know but that's uh, that's another weird story and um, I guess I'm well this battery on the camera is a little low but I might let it go a little longer but um, I'm currently on the, um, the Blanchard Fur Road going east and um, Blanchard is a small town um, not far from Shreveport kind of between Texas and Shreveport I'll try for another little story. I was riding through here years ago and it was 
a little bit later than now. It was on a Sunday morning, so there wasn't any traffic. And uh, I came up behind a couple that were riding Harleys. And uh, these were really nice bikes. And they were only going 35. It was in the uh, springtime. And, uh, and they were just enjoying the ride. And I didn't really care to pass. I was just going 35 right behind them, you know. And I enjoyed watching them ride, thinking how much fun that would be. And uh, just a great little memory I have. Uh, this is the way I used to come home every day for years. But this is the first time I've been this way at this time of morning in quite some time, but um, yeah, that was a nice little memory. They seemed very happy and, and they were enjoying their ride. Um, yeah, just a little ride out in the country. Okay. Well, I'll stop there and um, this is Barry, your host. Channel name is Explore with Barry and Lanyap. Thank you for watching.